Hi, it's Lucy here. So I'm trying to do my introduction for my new weekly workout and Princess Sultana, um, my cat, is very keen to, to help with that today. Anyway, so what I wanted to do is just quickly run through. Again, this week we are just going to have two moves, which this time we're going to look, oh, here we go again, she just looked backwards and forwards, is doing the squat and kick. And then we are also going to look at doing an exercise that I call the the walkabout. And with that one, which is clearly what Princess Sultana is doing right now, that works the whole of your body. So the idea is this routine is really simple to follow. We do 10 repetitions of each exercise. Then we go eight repetitions, then six, four, and two, which gives you that full body workout, which is what makes this workout so effective. Um, and what I'd like you to do is if you can aim to do it between three to four times a week would be amazing. If you've got any comments, you can always let me know in the comments box And below. if you like the videos, or if you like Sultana, Princess Sultana, then please do um, share them on Facebook, because you can tag your friends in. And also, that's a really good way to um, challenge them to get fit with you as well on there. So um, let's get ready, grab your trainers, and let's start training. So for this first round, you're going to do 10 squat and kicks for me. The key thing is squat nice and low and really punch with the arm. Take that leg as high as you can and also focus on keeping those abdominals nice and tight for me. Okay, so exercise two is called the walkout. So you're gonna walk out and then you walk those hands back in. So this is actually a full body move. It's actually really quite tough, even though it's what we call a low impact, it's still working what we call high intensity. And also the great one is here whilst you're doing this, just think you're working your arms, you're working your abdominals, you work your bottom, you work your hamstrings, and you're also getting really good, what we call core stability, Plus you're also getting amazing hamstring flexibility on there. So just keep that going, walk it in and walk that back out. That's good, well done. And keep those hips low as you come down into that fully extended plank position. So walk it out, hold and then come back up. That's good, we're nearly done. Keeping that going and then walking that back up. Excellent, well done. Okay, and let's just take that down. Last one for me and then extend back up, fantastic. Okay, so we're now on to round two, which means we're gonna do eight repetitions of each exercise. So that's eight squat and kicks. And remember, squat low and kick high. So this one here is great for burning calories plus toning that lower body. Keeping that going. All right, so let's take that to exercise two and we're gonna do eight of our walkouts on here. Now remember with this one, it's a slower move and this one here, we are working near enough every single muscle in the body. This is a really good exercise on here. Key thing is, make sure you keep those tummy muscles in nice and tight for me as you walk down and also maintain that as you hold that into that plank position. The fitter you get, the easier these will become. It looks easy, but this one is really quite a tough exercise. But again, the tougher the exercise, the better the results we get. So we're nearly done, keeping that going. That's good, last couple coming up. We'll get out and back, that's good. And then let's just go once more on there. Take it out and then coming back up. Okay, so we're on to round three. This time, we're just gonna go six reps of each. So squat and kick. Squat low, kick up. That's good, keeping that nice control. Well done, pushing that through. All right, let's get ready for our walkout. So again, this time now, we're just doing six repetitions. Walk those hands out slowly. Keep those tummy muscles pulled in nice and tight. Bend through the knees as you walk out and then come back up. That's good. Holding that there and extend. So just remember with this one, you're working your arms, you're working your abdominals, you're also working your chest, you're working your arms and your legs. Let's just go last one on there. Okay, so now round four, this time we're just doing four repetitions. So just four, Squat and kick, nice and low. Make sure you're really squatting low and kick high. All right, let's come to four of those walkouts. So we're back there. And again, just walk those hands out in front. Keep those abs really nice and tight for me. 
come back up. And extend. Well done. We've got two more. Let's keep that focused. And again, walk it back down. All right, so we're now on the last round. So just two squat kicks and so make sure you squat really low for me and then kick really high and let's finish off for the walk out for just two for me. Walk it out, hold those abs really tight, walk it back and let's go last one and take that back, hold and then just extend up, fantastic. So well done, that's your workout complete. Remember, it is important to cool down and stretch. I really hope you liked it. And if you come back to my YouTube channel next week, you're gonna have a new workout. And please do, if you enjoyed it, then please do share it.